Hello and welcome to Joburg Today. My name is Simi Lapo, bringing you the best of what's going down in and around Johannesburg. Glenn Fiddick hosted their Unsung Mavericks event celebrating ordinary citizens as top innovators who have showcased a pioneering spirit in their career paths. Let's take a look at what went down. Credit is given to those who break the rules and go against the grain to bring us something special. In this case, CEO of Indalo, Inga Kubeka, has broken the mold with his decor and lifestyle designs, resulting in Glenn Fiddick tipping their heads to him as an unsung maverick. I'm very humbled, I'm honored, and uh, I feel like uh, I'm very fortunate, you know, to be one of the um, Africans, you know, um, you know, to, to, to own one of these, you know. Uh, I think it's a, it's a very humbling experience, quite frankly. I'm, I'm really excited. Apart from his designs, Inga is the first African to have his own signature single malt whiskey infusing his chosen flavors. And this is what it takes to be a maverick, according to Ivan Goers. It's just dedication, passion, uh, focus. Um, I just believe that uh, one shouldn't rush, you know, like to to making money, even though money is important. But you must just be an objective and focus, and just be passionate about what you do, about your craft. Well, I believe a maverick. Or well, let me speak about myself. You need to stay true to who you are and know what you want out of life, and you must, you know, you must go all out to go get that. The thing that makes me stand out is dedication and understanding of the things that I'm trying to do. This is a unique brand. It involves pioneering spirit. It involves you standing out in a crowd. And I think I do that physically because I'm quite tall, but I stand out because I, I believe that work defines who you are. So I work hard to make sure that my work speaks to who I am. And you've all heard it, ladies and gentlemen, being a good maverick involves being passionate about what you do and also putting in the hard work. Um, for my show, for Dover today. Join in on the conversation by using the hashtag Glenfiddich Mavericks. Like us on Facebook, JoeBigToday.tv, and follow us on Twitter at JoeBigToday. If you're one of those that are constantly on the move, do catch us on PocketTV.mobi, and that's Pocket with an I. Fabiani is a renowned menswear brand that is stylish and sophisticated. Since the proof is in the pudding, I just had to get a taste. Fabiani is a men's brand um, inspired by Italian, South African brand, which was established in 1978. Uh, Co-founder was Jeff Fabian, and his son later joined him into the business, Ari Fabian. Our target market is actually everyone that's stylish, you know, because we've looked at it and every, there's a bit of everything for everyone in our store. So if you want to be a man in suiting, if you want to be a guy in um, joggers, we've got all that, so you just need to know how to mix it up. I'll tell you one thing with Fabiani, uh, what makes Fabiani unique from other brands is that we are very formal but we also playful. So it's like people are not, like men are not scared to actually walk into our store because there's that playful vibe and everybody feels welcomed and not intimidated. So you've just taken me through the store, it's absolutely cool and you got me my new threads, we like it. But um, just tell us like why exactly did you choose particularly these items for me? Okay, so how I usually go through my thought process when styling someone uh, is I listen to what you have to say, right? And if you, I don't know if you've noticed lately, like for guys, um, it's it's just now that we've discovered accessories, you know. So hence why I went for the velvet um, royal blue bow tie, the royal blue um, electric um, bomber. Uh, just to you know, accentuate that adventurous spirit that you spoke about. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, the happy socks also bring it out quite nicely. Fabiani's heritage is formal wear. So with our new autumn winter campaign, A Return to Form, we're bringing the focus back into our suiting, which is our heritage. Uh, but now with that, we've also inherited a bit of uh, a new streetwear, which is sort of like what the trend is moving towards. I mean, you, in order for us to stay relevant, we need to stay with, with the trends and be sort of like ahead of the curve a little uh, as a fashion brand. So there's a, a lot of that. Uh, you'll see a lot of blues coming through, a lot of uh, sport luxury, uh, sweats and, and that. Um, so yeah.
I'm Adam Foley and you're watching Joburg Today. That's all for today. For more on the city, do check out our playlist. From myself, Dumin Klapo, I now leave you with Jeremy Loops and Down South. Back in the TV. I didn't want you. 